Welcome back to Raw Sports Talk. I'm Chris, your favorite stat reader, and we have the Clippers hosting the Raptors, and the Clippers are seven and a half point favorites. The over under is at two twenty six and a half. The Raptors are plus two eighty on the money line. The Clippers are minus three fifty five. Now these are the overnight odds. They're going to change the closer we get to tip off tomorrow. The Clippers have yet to play the game that they have to play tonight. Uh, they play the Kings. That game didn't tip off yet in Sacramento, so they will have to travel back home. I imagine their lineups will be the same as what they are tonight. Imag- barring anyone gets hurt. Man, Jones, Zubak, Powell, and Harden for the uh, Clippers. And then when we go to the Raptors, quickly, Dick, Barrett, Ajabaji, and Podal. And quickly is listed as questionable. And there's like 15 points that they've been missing from their lineup for God knows how long. Head-to-head, the Clippers are 8-2. The Clippers are on a four-game winning streak. The home team is 5-5. Five five. The favorite is Six and four against the spread. The favorite is nine and one on the money line. The favorites won the last three games on the money line. The under is seven and three, and the under at two twenty six and a half or two twenty seven. I've seen it at both. Is seven and three. They played each other three times last year. The Clippers won all three games, but this is a different Clippers team because you know no more Paul George. The Raptors are just. I want to say just terrible, but uh, that doesn't really seem to do them justice. One and six in their last seven. 256, 259, 240, 229. Six-point loss to the Lakers, they covered. Three-point win over the Kings, they covered. Two-point loss to the Nuggets, they covered. Uh, 14-point loss to the Kings, they did not cover. The Clippers are on a two-game winning streak, not including the game that they have to play tonight against the Kings. 244, 197, 217, and then 208 points. Six-point loss to the Suns, didn't cover. 13-point loss to the Thunder, didn't cover. The next two games they did. A nine-point win over the Spurs, and then a 12-point win over the Sixers. I'm going to take the Clippers on the money line. I will take the Raptors getting as many points as I can because... They've been keeping these games close, and I'm going to also go over. I think the back-to-back will hurt them, and quickly coming back is 15 points a game that the Raptors have been missing. So we'll see if we see some offense. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut, and please bet responsibly.